So to find the perfect Gcam for your Android device, you have to install Telegram and it's a very simple process. Just search for Gcam Finder and you're going to meet a bot. There is that. So just open it up and now you have to type in start. And now what it's going to give you is a different sort of menu. Now you have to select Gcam download from there. And from there, you have to select your phone model. I'm gonna download for Xiaomi's Poco F1. So I'm gonna select Xiaomi, then I'm gonna go to Poco. And from there, I'm gonna select Poco F1. So now it's gonna give me two options. First is to download the APK. Second is to download the XML. APK is in itself the Gcam and XMLs uh, have the specific settings for that specific Gcam. So it's gonna give you the best performance. So download the APK and download the XML, both of them. So I'm just gonna download the APK right now. And then I'm just gonna go back and I'm gonna download the XML. After downloading the XML, just save it uh, to your downloads and then that's it. Now you have to go into any file manager and create a folder namely Gcam. After Gcam, you have to create another folder in that. So I'm just gonna go a little bit slower here. After Gcam, now create another folder, configs 7. Now if you're downloading a Gcam 6, then you don't have to put 7 at the end. But we are downloading a configs uh, Gcam 7, so we have to put the 7 at the end. Now we have to copy that XML file, that Poco F1 V7 Nikita Gcam, this file to the uh, folder that we have just created. Now I'm just gonna go copy and then put it in Gcam config 7 here. Now XML thing is done, totally done. Now we have to install that APK again. I'm gonna go there and so now we are about to complete this process. Now we just have to install the APK that we have just downloaded and I'm just gonna hit on install and if you receive any prompts just go into the settings and enable everything. It's totally safe so you don't have to worry about that. And I'm just gonna wait here till it installs. And now I am gonna open it up and allow it all the permissions that it needs uh, like camera storage and stuff. So now uh, next to the shutter button uh, in between that gallery button you have to double tap and then you're gonna receive that kind of menu. Then you just have to tap on restore and you are done. The X XML has been restored, the settings have been done. You have the Gcam which is gonna give you so much better quality than your stock camera obviously. So I think I'm pretty much done here and this is the best way that I've found to get a really good Gcam. And here are some of the samples that I took with Gcam and some of these are actually taken with a really old phone that's actually like 3 to 4 years old budget phone on Gcam so you can understand how uh, great it does. And also I want to say a big thank you to all the people who are maintaining this bot, uh, who are maintaining Gcam applications and this, whoever has made this bot as well. So everyone, thank you so much for all those and thank you for watching this video. I'll catch you in the next one.